Yeah, I mean, the, the main motivation what, to, to what I'm doing today is just creating an environment in which other people can grow. Now, the problem with that comes uh, is like, imagine you have a company, right? Or you have a company. So you have a company, you have a couple of people in the company. And then uh, let's skip the hiring process. Let's say we've done the hiring kind of well. We have the right people with the right mindset. But at the same time, people are always going to function on a, some sort of a scale, right? Let's say one of the things you want to measure is their wish to develop themselves, to grow, to become better versions of themselves and whatnot. There is a group of people who don't want that. They don't want to grow. They don't need it. It's not motivational to them. It's not intrinsically. It's not inside motivation. And it's not their type of self-realization, right? Then you have some group, a small group of people who have the, you know, the complete opposite. They want to grow all the time. They want to learn everything, whatever they have their hands on. They want to know more about it. They want to study all the time. But both of these extremes have a shadow, right? Yeah. The shadow of the people who don't want to grow is stagnation. And the shadow of the people who want to grow all the time is overwhelming. Mm -hmm. uh, they can get overwhelmed uh, and it may become it become a little bit superficial, you know, kind of a little bit about everything, but not really anything in detail. Uh, so these two are extremes. Now, my intention was always to create a space for everyone to use their potential if they want to. So that's a very non-violent approach to, to uh, education and development. I also believe that managers, owners, leaders, their role is not to push people to get better. It's to, their main role is to create environment in which they can, mm. right? So, and this is where that my motivation mainly lies is to be helpful, to be almost a tool, if you want to call it that way, that enables to create this kind of environment where we can grow in a safe way, sure, with, with small risks on the way and small failures and small small hiccups. That's great. I mean, mistakes are good if mm -hmm. they are not if they're not gonna kill you. Uh, and 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 my role is is to identify, help, give tools, provide space, be a soundboard, and basically be responsible for being for the for the um, environment to be in place for people to grow rather than to be responsible for the people's growth. Yeah.